As daylight breaks and the sun wakes up, the birds start singing their songs. I sit right here next to my dad since I can barely walk. He taught me the track to be quiet and still. It's in my blood, it's in my veins. I had an addiction and obsession, enough to drive us all insane. We trust in our friends and our family. God and our country, faith in the Bible land of the free. It's a who I wanna be. For the thrill of the hunt, hey, we're always in rut. Sometimes it's our salvation. That's why we're proudly a part of the donation. It's this time in the woods that helps us grow up, respect the land, and believe in God. It ushers us to manhood, it helps our spirits come alive. Drag racked and scrapes, lock ons and blinds, buck fever till we die. We're through plots of saw blocks just for that shot to let that arrow fly. We trust in friends and our family, God and our country. Faith in the Bible and the free, it's who I want to be. For the thrill of the hunt, hey, we're always in love. Hey, welcome to Donation Outdoors. I'm Stephen Caudill. And I'm Brett Williams. This week's episode, we're going to highlight Full Draw Archery. They're a sponsor of ours, and they have just gone above and beyond this year. We actually went up early, or actually it was this summer, we went up and we shot in a breast cancer awareness uh, 3D archery shoot. So we met a lot of the guys. Some of those guys had footage. They said, hey, do y'all want to see some of our footage? And one of them, Charlie, you'll see later in the show, killed a monster buck. He was about 180. So, I mean, it's just some great footage. Teresa, he turned around and filmed her. So, they kind of, she filmed him, he filmed her, right. she got a doe. We also got some turkey footage from the spring. You know, the guys, I think we kind of got them excited That's with right. all of us doing the videography and talking about it. Those guys went out, got some cameras, got pop up blinds, and took some turkeys. So, there's some great footage. We got Tim, Keith, uh, Ronnie, and Ronnie's grandson. They're going to be killing some turkeys. They're going to kill a doe, and we're going to kill a really nice buck at Monster. the end of this episode. Right. So stay tuned. It's going to be great. You're watching Donation Outdoors. So what is Donation Outdoors? Donation Outdoors is an outdoor hunting show, which we directly partnership with local communities to help serve those through the Elmore County Food Pantry and other areas. We donate 100% of our harvest to whitetail to help serve those in need. If you're interested in partnering up with us or want more information about what we do, go to our website which is donation.tv, D-O-E, nation.tv. If you're a hunter and you enjoy the sport of hunting, you're familiar with camouflage. Hello, I'm Jerry Willis, mayor here in the city of Wetumpka. I'd like to invite you to come and be a part of the exciting times here in Wetumpka. The redevelopment of our downtown is in full bloom. A lot of good things are happening, making it a safe place for people to come and live and play here in the city of Wetumpka. We're not wanting to camouflage the city of Wetumpka. So I welcome you to come and enjoy what Wetumpka has to offer. Lake Martin Mini Mall, located at 7995 Collider Road, Eclectic, Alabama, is the place to find your home decorating needs. Shopping for a big green egg? Lake Martin Mini Mall carries one of the largest inventories in the region. Lake Martin Mini Mall has outdoor furniture that provides comfort, durability, and beauty to complete your outdoor entertainment. Also, hundreds of garden pots, fountains, and garden art. Your locally owned Lake Martin Mini Mall, the best in home, garden, and lake living essentials. First are important because how you start out matters. A first home together is an investment in your future. And the people at First Community Bank are uniquely genuine in how they take care of you all along the way. A new step in your independence is a day you'll always remember. And so will we. At First Community Bank, you will always come first. Welcome back to Donation Outdoors.
Good afternoon. Hey, Ronnie. How, How are you doing, doing guys? Good. Good to see you again. Good to see you. Y'all hey, have, have a good drive up. Yeah, good trip. Good to see you. Good to see y'all guys. Good to see y'all too. We're here to see if y'all can do any help on, get some help on our bows. Get these tuned in. I need a new string on mine. Yeah, I'm going to get you a new string on it. I tell you, this time of year is a good time to get it done before season. You know, two or three months before season, you get the string broke in, and, uh, get your sights reset and everything. So we can get, you, we can get you taken of care of. Yeah, you can tell it's been shipped. That's good. Thank you. But we can get you going. Sure yeah. can. Let's get started. All right. Donation Outdoors will be right back after these messages from our following sponsors. Live life at full draw. Instead of ordering archery supplies from a big box store and trying to get help from a computer, do business with guys that really hunt and will talk directly with you. Full Draw Archery offers over 20,000 items on their website with same-day shipping. I'm Ronnie. And I'm Keith. Experience you can trust, and we answer the phone, text, and email. Shop Full Draw Archery HSV.com for crossbows, arrows, clothing, broadheads, and personal service. Full Draw Archery HSV.com. There are dozens of reasons why you might need a tree service, but only one name you need to remember, A&O Tree Service. Whether you need to remove dead or dangerous trees, clean up after a big storm, or get rid of an ugly stump, A&O Tree Service is ready to help you. Owner James Gates is experienced, licensed, and bonded. A&O can also clear land, haul away debris or uplift trees. They even sell firewood. No job is too big or too small for A&O Tree Service, your local professional helping hands. Welcome back to Donation Outdoors. Hey everyone, Keith here at Full Draw Archery. Down here at the Bow Up Shoot, trying to get an archery shoot in here today. I was just going to let everybody know, hey, uh, my turkey hunt this year, uh, I was lucky enough to kill one with my bow. Uh, one of our partners, Tim, he was lucky enough to kill one with his bow. So we just had a, had a real good hunt this year. The season went pretty good for all of us at Full Draw Archery. Keith here at Full Draw Archery. Hey, me and Justin got it done this morning with the Hoyt bow, the basement decoys. Got on a pretty good bird up here this morning. They gobbled right behind us, pitched out of the field. Me and my cameraman Justin got the blind early this morning. Got some birds out in the field and they're coming this way, so we'll see if we can get one. Where's this history, man? Gotta go try to get another one in the morning. Full draw archery. We're up here in Middle Tennessee trying to do some midday turkey hunting with our bows. We're over here in an area where we've seen a, a big gobbler with some hands, and I've got some decoys sitting out there with a the Jake, and I'm hoping that I can entice him to come in here and get in a fight with that Jake. He's focused on that Jake. Everything that, uh, that we do was out of full draw archery. All my equipment was, was really top notch. It had rained on me. Uh, everything was still set. Uh, my, my equipment was flawless. So, and that's just a testimony to having your stuff professionally done. Everything tuned, get it walk back tuned. Uh, arrows uh, being right for the type of weight, draw length you are. You don't want an arrow flexing too much. You don't want arrow flexing too little. And so, you want, a, you want a pro in a pro archery shop to set you up like that because you can be very successful today with the equipment you got. They've got great equipment. Every bow line out there is top notch. And at Full Draw, they carry all the top lines. They carry every line you may want. And uh, it, it, if you're out there and you've had some frustrating times maybe shooting archery, and it, it's probably your setup. If you'll, if you'll go to a professional and have him set you up right and have listen to him and let him set you up for success 
you'll walk out there and in no time you're drilling 20 yards you're, you're drilling like this and, and in, you, you practice just a little bit you, you'll have a great time archery hunting it's a great experience because you get to encounter the animals right on top of you and that's kind of why guys graduate to go archery because they lose that that adrenaline and that excitement because they're they're detached from 100 yards out shooting with a rifle you're detached and as an adult for kids it's great and I'm not against uh, gun hunting but uh, as you kind of get more advanced as a hunter you guys usually go to archery and that's why and so if you're a guy out there that's watching the show and he says man that looks really fun my advice is to go to a professional and let him help you and you'll have success you'll have some success and and we'll grow the sport and and the industry donation outdoors will be right back after these messages from our following sponsors Live life at full draw. Instead of ordering archery supplies from a big box store and trying to get help from a computer, do business with guys that really hunt and will talk directly with you. Full Draw Archery offers over 20,000 items on their website with same day shipping. I'm Ronnie. And I'm Keith. Experience you can trust. And we answer the phone, text, and email. Shop Full Draw Archery HSV.com for crossbows, arrows, clothing, broadheads, and personal service. Full Draw Archery HSV.com. We'll make it a call to clean all this up. Well, that's easy. Call Granger Land Service. I'm Mike. Give us a call today. Let us enhance your property. At Tallahassee Automotive, our Drive and Discover event is going on now. Enjoy 20% off MSRP. That's an average savings of $5,000 off on select Chrysler 200 models. One drive in one of our new Chrysler vehicles, and you'll discover why great deals are worth exploring. You can drive off with a great deal today. Come by and see us, our friendly staff in the beautiful city of Tallahassee, Alabama, or visit us online at TallahasseeAutomotive.com. A short drive from high prices. Welcome back to Donation Outdoors. Hey everybody, this is Ronnie from Full Draw Archery in Huntsville, Alabama. We're up here at the Coleman Breast Cancer Shoot uh, to raise money for breast cancer. Uh, had the whole shooting staff up today. We had 12, 15 people. Uh, been having fun with uh, Steven and uh, Brett. Uh, 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 we teamed up with donations this year. We're looking forward to what we can do with those guys and really appreciate them the opportunity to, to let us join up with them. Uh, we got some good turkey hunts. Uh, I know I took my grandson Caleb on a turkey hunt this past spring, his first turkey hunt. Got him in there with a, a Parker crossbow. He got a nice turkey. Uh, got short video on it. Uh, I was uh, lucky enough a couple of weeks later to take my PSE out and got me a pretty nice turkey with it. So it's been a good year so far. And like I said, we're looking forward to this fall and uh, seeing what we can do with donations. So it's, it's been a great partnership so far and we're looking forward to what the future holds. All right, this morning I woke up with my grandpa, uh, Ronnie Kimbrew, and uh, about 5.45, and we got ready, we went out to the barn, and the turkeys, they're all everywhere, you can just hear them. And uh, about 30 minutes, they all came out, and they're all crying around the decoy over there. And uh, I, at first I couldn't get a really good shot, the one he, uh, he wanted, but then I saw another one, and I was like, this one's gonna be a good one. So he said, shoot at it. And I shot at it, and I thought I missed. But I got him. You just, you just killed your first bird. So that was my journey this morning. Hey everybody, it's Ronnie at Full Draw Archery. Got in my blind this afternoon. Going to do a little turkey hunting. Uh, it's a instead of a blind, it's more like a sauna. It's pretty hot out here today. But just talk to you just a second. There's always going uh, debate about what broadheads to use for turkey hunting. And I'm telling you, my answer to that when people ask me at the shop, I always tell them whatever broadhead is accurate for you.
Ramcat did the number because I know the Ramcat's very accurate. That's the broadhead I choose, but there's a lot of broadheads out there on the market that do the same thing. And like I said, don't doubt your equipment. If you have confidence in your broadhead, your broadhead will take the animal down that you shoot, but you just gotta be accurate. You gotta know what it do. Like I said earlier, live life at full draw. And if we can help you with anything archery related, give us a call. Donation Outdoors will be right back after these messages from our following sponsors. Southern Steel and Pipe is located in Montgomery, Alabama. We carry one of the largest steel and pipe inventories in the area. Having over 80,000 square feet of manufacturing facility, this allows us to provide roofing for residential and commercial projects in a wide range of colors. We also manufacture pole barn trusses, pre-engineered metal buildings, and custom metal trim. We take pride in running an efficient operation and providing the best customer service you'll find anywhere. Call us today and you'll be surprised just how much money you can save. Real people steal people. From full-time professionals to weekend warriors, they trust steel and servicing steel dealers. Right now, hardworking steel blowers start at $139.95 and legendary steel chainsaws start at $179.95. Find your steel dealer at steeldealers.com or search STIHL. Real people steal people. Join us. Tallahassee Rehab is an outpatient physical therapy clinic providing services to Tallahassee and surrounding communities. Our state-of-the-art facility has a large rehab gym and therapeutic pool. We treat a variety of conditions including orthopedics, neurological, spine, pediatrics, and occupational injuries. Our highly skilled staff provides many specialty services including dry needling, sports medicine, athletic training, kinesio taping, EMGs, work hardening, FCEs, and vestibular rehab and we would be happy to assist you. If you'd like to take your cooking to the next level, Hardin's seasoning can get you there. A local staple in Montgomery, Alabama, Hardin's is great on beef, pork, chicken, fish, salads, baked potatoes, pretty much anything you want to eat. And if you're looking for other great ideas across the Southeast, check out thesouthernweekend.com. Food, travel, lifestyle. It's a celebration of the South. Come join the adventure at thesouthernweekend.com. Welcome back to Donation Outdoors. Hey folks, Charlie Rogers, Full Draw Archery uh, Pro Shooter. Uh, just here to talk about the, the last hunt that we did in Illinois during November. Uh, I think you'll enjoy it. Uh, last hunting trip was uh, Illinois rut, November, I think it was second week of November. Me and my girlfriend, Teresa, uh, we went up for, uh, for the week. We usually do every year do an annual hunt. Had a lot of a lot of good footage. <clears throat> the footage you'll see will be a, it's a 180, uh, 12 point, typical 12. And uh, we were probably two, 300 yards from the river, which is the Wabash River in Illinois. And you have to excuse the racket in the background. We we're at a breast cancer shoot, a fundraiser. So, so you have to excuse the racket. Um, but anyhow, we're, we're hunting and uh, Got in a good spot, got in their bedding area, got there real, real early because uh, they would be coming in from the fields and stuff. We want to be there early. And we're hunting real, real high. You'll notice in the footage that we're super, super high. Well, we didn't get it on footage, but kind of explain things. Uh, when the buck came out, we had cut some trails in the CRP and they, they tend to use those trails when they're cut. And uh, we had a really good buck, a shooter, come around this bend, which was 40 yards out. And he, he, he obviously crossed the river because he shook his fur. And he kind of checked things out, and then he left. So I'm sitting there with my bow, and I never got a shot. So uh, uh, later after that, later after that, uh, our, our buck that, that you'll see come in. And so when he steps out, I'd already ranged it. He's 40, so I, I drew early. And uh, well, lo and behold, he, he walks right at us. And so I'm holding, and I'm holding, and I'm holding, and I'm holding. And uh, finally, he's looking around, and, and evidently there were some smaller bucks back behind us. Um, so I let down, and he was close, and I, I did not want to mess this up. I wanted an exact range. I did not want to make a bad shot. And uh, I ranged him, and you'll see <clears throat> when, I, when I let my my rangefinder down, he, he eyeballs me. 
and stares at me really hard. Um, but ne never, never really gets on alert, and, and I don't know if he was kind of defending his territory. That's why he didn't spook or anything like that. But uh, he kind of got lazy-eyed again and backed out and went into this trail that I'd already pre-ranged. It was probably about 30 to 35 yards, somewhere in there. And he angled across in front of us, and I got a break in the... I had a break there where I could I could shoot. You'll see that on footage. All right, all right. He ran, he ran really hard, and that, that concerned me. But we ended up, ended up finding him. Uh, 180, 175 to 180 buck. Probably on the hoof was uh, 300 pounds, and so it's a really, really good deer. Uh, I had my pin on there. I broke it good too. Yeah, you did. I'm glad this thing has the anti has the stabilizer on it because I was shaking like crazy. <laughs> oh my god, he's beautiful. That's a 150 inch deer. He's, he's beautiful. 50. He's beautiful. You got it on still? Oh yeah. What do you think? Yeah, I shot him in a 30, he was 28. There's another one. Wow. Wow. That's the most... That's the... That, he's beautiful. I grunted a while ago, hit some grunts, and I had a nice, nice chocolate eight come in right there at that point, and he was heavy. And he was looking, and I had some smaller looks come easing in real cautious. And then, uh, about 10 minutes later, this guy came in. And I thought he wasn't shooting until he got out of here. I realized he was. And, uh, I think I put a pretty good shot on him, so we're about to get down and uh, go look at the arrow. Give him a little bit of time. And uh, go see if we can find him. been a long long day we finally found him and I you can tell with the shot right there I don't know how he ran as far as he ran um, but he did he's a strong animal and we're thinking he may be in the high 150s maybe I don't know he's one of my best bucks Teresa hung in there with me. She climbed 30 feet up the tree stand, hung up in there. Been here all week filming. So we got it done. He's a good one. He's a good one. So, uh, celebrate. It's time to celebrate. Hey guys, we're gonna demonstrate real quick how easy it is to use a simple hang. So we got a powder coated hook weatherproof with a rubber stopper and that's going to grip anything that you hang from the tree. You've got a cord lock right here that simply slides up and down so when I demonstrate it in a minute you'll see how you can adjust your simple hang. It's just that easy. You just simply loop it around the tree, cinch it tight and then you can adjust it to any height you want. As you can see I got our bow hanging here, some binoculars, our hunting bag, you can hang anything. You don't have to have a limb. You can use our simple hang this is how easy it comes off. You can use a simple hang on any stand you got. A lock on, you can hang it from your ratchet strap. You can hang it from a ladder stand off the side. Anything that you can loop it around and cinch it to holds this simple hang. So that's it. That's the simple hang. Go to our website, dnohuntinggear.com, to get yours. Hello, I'm Shane Russell, lead pastor of Shoal Creek Baptist Church in Deetsville, Alabama, and welcome to Hunting Grace on Donation Outdoors. In this week's episode, uh, it's focusing on Full Draw Archery, one of the sponsors, and one of their pro staff shooters, Charlie Rogers, was able to take a 180 inch typical 12 point, an Illinois deer, a giant of a deer, 
And in that particular scene, he, he was surprised when this big deer entered into his life. But you know that there are times in life where the, the big surprises aren't necessarily as good as seeing a 180 inch deer walk in. On this episode as well, they were at a archery shoot for cancer awareness. And see, I know personally about the, the big surprises of life when it comes to cancer. In 2013, I found out that I had cancer. And man, what a great surprise that was. It was a really trying time in my life and my family's life. I have a beautiful wife and five children and a lot of things begin to run through your mind. But on those big surprises, did you know that God is still sovereign, sovereign over it all? The Lord worked in my life miraculously. They were able to remove the cancer and I'm here today because of God's grace. But here's what I want to share with you. Why do we go through these big challenges? The Apostle Paul tells us in 2 Corinthians that God comforts us in the big challenges of life so that we can comfort others. And so maybe you're walking through a big challenge. It may not be cancer. It may be something else. But God is with you through those challenges. The scripture tells us to be strong and courageous for he never leaves us and never forsakes us. I can tell you from a personal testimony, I know that's true. And so as you're walking through life, would you look to the God who is in control of all circumstances? My prayer is that this year, the big surprise will be 180 inch 12 point. But if it's not, I want you to look to the God of heaven who will never leave you and never forsake you. Hey Donation fans, like what you see? Watch our guys on Instagram, Facebook, Twitter, and also, they also have a website, donation.tv. Donation. Donation Outdoors is also being brought to you by the following sponsors. Trailer World, we build it, we stand behind it, let us prove it. Standard air conditioning and heating, setting the standard in comfort. Recon Outdoors, where successful hunting adventures begin. Russell Dewitt Center in Eclectic, Alabama. Quality, experience, and service. Shaw Insurance Agency. Auto, home, life, and business. Johnson Furniture, with locations in Eclectic and Greenville to serve you better. TA Wear, satisfaction guaranteed. A-plus deer processing, a.k.a. the meat barn. Simple Hang, stop screwing around. Playlist Production, your music and media production company. Hey guys, I'm Cameron Mitchell. We're here at the uh, 2017 Bull Against Breast Cancer 3D Archery Tournament. Um, this is our sixth year to have this event. and uh, in, in total, we raised uh, close to $130,000 for the Breast Cancer Research Foundation of Alabama. It's a great event. I'm Brian Granger. I sit on the board here with the BC uh, RFA, and all the funds raised today go strictly towards or straight towards uh, breast cancer research here in Alabama. It doesn't go outside the state or anything else or any other cancer. It goes straight towards breast cancer. Okay, we need to